I wrote something in my journal today about self-love and about how all of these things are, are they're required for us, but they're also gifts to ourself. Like they're, they're also a way for you to express love for yourself and you have to love yourself to be able to love your business and other people. So just some perspective on that for you all, if you're challenging that, or I saw somebody said something like, um, oh yeah, you're calling me out on my lunch. Like, just make sure that you're doing those things. And I have a lot of room to talk because a lot of times I'm talking to Anna at nine o'clock at night and she's like, you need to shut everything down and go to bed. But, um, but I just, I wanted to share that with you all. Cause I think it's so important to make sure that that's a priority for us, especially as, as independent business owners. I absolutely agree. And it's one of those things that we forget. I, and this is part of why building a shadow framework that lives on your calendar is actually really helpful because it's, you see it consistently and it helps remind you. It's not meant to like scold you at all. It is meant to help keep you in a place where you are working in your ideal day every day. And that doesn't mean that every day is going to be ideal. Trust me, it's not. But it also is a place for you to feel like it's giving you the control to make those decisions. But it's also reminding you that you have those things built in. So those things that need to live on your calendar consistently, like your meditation time, or if you have kids, you should be um, blocking those spaces where you want to be home for your kids or working from home. Like I have a client who's like, look, my teenager comes home from school and two days a week, it's my job to pick her up from school. So I leave my office at two o'clock and I pick her up at two 30 and I want to be home and with her from two to six. And I want I can work because she's doing things like homework, but I don't want to be on calls. And I'm like, cool. So let's just block that and make sure that that time block doesn't get added to any booking link whatsoever. And if you make an exception, that is a personal decision that you have made in order to give people access. And that is the important part of this because it's about making sure that you have time balanced for you. This is not about anybody else because if people want to work with you and they want to engage with you, they will work within the time frames that you get make available to them. So do not sacrifice your self-care in order to make more time for people. People will make it work for you. You need to make sure that you are giving yourself your own framework and taking care of yourself in the process. So that's what I say start with. So that's also why I say do not forget to add the personal time stuff to your calendar. <laughs> 